All right, thank you, Michael. So the Lakers will once again have their hands full trying to slow Harden down tonight. What a way to begin their stretch run out of the playoffs, three games behind the eighth seed in the West. Even with LeBron back on the roster, ESPN's BPI gives them just a 6% chance to make the postseason. In their remaining schedule, it's the fourth hardest in the league with BPI favoring them in just nine of their remaining games. So here is LeBron on this stretch run. I love being uncomfortable. I fall in love with being uncomfortable, so this is another uncomfortable thing for me, and I love it. Do you feel like the team is in a good mental space then moving forward right now? Yeah. Everyone is um, excited to get back on. And live from L.A., Brian, this team, this Lakers team, has a lot of ground to make up. Uh, what do you say? How, how much of a shot do you realistically give them to make the playoffs? Well, Sage, we have to be honest here. The Lakers are really an average team, and they're an average team that's had a lot of injuries, and that's why they're really below the, the, the middle of the pack right now. So for them to overcome that, for them to get to the eighth seed, and to be honest with you, they should be targeting seven. That's what they need to get. They need LeBron James to be great. Well, since he's come back from his injury, he's been good, but they don't have a margin for error. They don't have a margin for error in any game the rest of the way. If we see a great LeBron James, which I believe is there, we will see the Lakers in the postseason. It really comes down to number 23. Targeting the seventh seed in order to avoid the Warriors there, the 1 8 matchup? Absolutely. Yeah, the seventh seed is within their reach. They're three games behind the eight, four games behind the seven. They get the seven. There's a lot of things still possible. They get the yeah. eight. We're talking about extending the season by a week. Yeah, exactly. A sweep. Well, LeBron James said it. He loves being uncomfortable. He is right there in that spot as they begin the stretch run. Brian Winhorst.